Hello, welcome to a Jade Kind Video Gaming. My name is Adam here as Rizargo, and um, we've we've been progressing a little bit on the main quest. And I was thinking, like, I mean, y you want to get that third house, you can start thinking about the property options. And I was thinking, I was like, wasn't I working on that? And I think that's why I went and killed a giant. So I remember being on a cliff top and having to like try and kill a giant before he got to me, because he'd kill me. Um, I I don't remember if I did what I needed to like for the giant. I feel like this guy's running right at me. I'm no one special. Just a miner who swings a pickaxe for his drinking money. Nope. These that ago was just happened to be there. Oh, the the miners are all. There must be some They're sort of mine. Miners. I don't want any trouble. Mm. They say that that These that ago already has, has a miner of his own. Anyways, I was like, I was like, was it was I just short on money? Because I think I got enough money now. Just a servant of Skald the Elder. I'm Skald's house, Carl, and head of his guard in Dawnstar. You're not as dumb as you look. Yes, it is. Exactly, I was wondering about yeah, that land. The southern part of the Pale, right on the border with White Run Hold. Wonderful. All the room in the world to build your own house. Oh, Exactly, will take it. Wonderful. I'll sleep better knowing you're watching the Southern Marches. Here's the title to your standing. Just follow the road south from Dawn Star, past Fort Dunstad, then head south. The land is near Giant's Gap, right on the border with White Run Hold. You'll almost be inside of the Laureus Farm, in fact. Don't bother me again unless it's important. Rizargo thought that was important. Rizargo just gave you 5,000 gold. Actually, kind of nice, because I was saying that. Um, you know, in order to get this property, you had to go by, and just this would be the place where I get rid of the giant. Now it says cleared, and I could fast travel there, and there's probably not a giant there, but there's a decent chance there's still mammoths there. I'm like, I'd rather go to the farm. It's like that seems like the better. Better place to travel to. Because, like... Ah. These are our remembers. Yeah. Because when I had to go to the giant's place, for example, I decided to come up and come from White Run rather than go the other way and go past that fort as well. So, hmm. Is that go remember us being attacked by some wolves? I think. Been passing through here before. Uh, Is that go? Does not remember for sure. There's not going to be any building right now, so here we are. It's like, as I'm looking for it, it's like, uh, it's not so clear what I'm looking for. Probably have to go over here. There's a chopping block. Ah, yeah, there we go. Yes. 
and uh, we'll just start with the nails. Probably something like that is a probably a good starting distribution. Ta -da 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 -da. Let's drop off some extra things here. Store. Don't need that. Or that. Maybe. Just the those. There's a fair bit of weight. I got things put in. I have the basic first haul put in, and it's enough. I can uh, walk around a bit, see the idea of like where this property is. There's giants that away. You do get a lot of, like, a vast view. Like, just how far you can see. This side here, looking up the mountain. Hmm. Yeah, no, very nice. I'm not gonna. This whole episode is not gonna be this. Okay. Although it is a little investigating around it. Because that's not natural stone. I hate the idea of going towards one of the giant markers. But I don't think that this is the giant. Like. Marker. There's someone here. Hello. I say while sneaking and 
obviously not really trying to get someone's attention. It seems this has all been abandoned. And is there for Rizargos. It does not say stealing. <laughs> Rizargo is not so rude as to uh, lift the potato. If I recall, and it's been a long time since I've actually played this game, but if I recall, that is a passage Ooh. Um, to, like, basically the Underdark. Whatever they call it in this game. Oh, look at how big the moon is. So, that is def- Like, how close that is, is definitely a noteworthy feature for this property. I mean, it's like... I mean, like, my- You know, the Underdark entrance is, like, right there. It's like, do you really want to raise a family on- the door to the Underdark, because I'm, I'm not sure. Also, a lot of giants right around here. I, I came back so that I could um, get something here. No. There's where I still stuff like that. So, But I know I got some metal. So I feel like I have, I mean, I don't even know which one of those I can melt down. Because I know, like, when it comes to, like, the dwarven bits of metal, like, some of them you can melt down and turn into, like, dwarven ingots. And some you can't. And I do not remember... Which are which? Decisions, decisions. Let's work on this one. Rizargo could consider adoption. But Rizargo will have to do a little more homesteading before it gets to that. And I will. Probably in not too long. In fact, the reason I'm not... Disrespect the law and you disrespect me. Rizargo does not wish to disrespect the law, but perhaps you. By the gods. Dragon. Uh. Rizargo does not really particularly care for this. Frost.
I now, by the way, I remember why I was working on the main quest. It's because it, I believe at some point through it, you get the um, ability just to shout the dragons to the ground. And obviously that would make things easier. Sit here. Oh, he's flying again. Let's heal. Oh, he's landing. Let's shoot him. Heal again. Oh, he's landing. Really? You cannot decide. Where'd he go? I think he threw some guards over this way. Like he picked him up and there it was. I need more than one of that costume, but... Anyways. I don't appear to get an actual marker to find that mage. So between starting housing stuff that I will work on more later and then here, a little elvish, and then the dragon, uh, most of the episodes taken up with yes. all that, eh? Hmm? 
Ranmir beg a drink from you yet? That's gold wasted, friend. Yuri Zarago is curious what is wrong with Ranmir. He owes this tavern enough coin to burn it down, build it back up, then burn it down again just for laughs. He's How much coin does it cost to burn room, down this tavern? I can't have him drinking here without at least paying back some of the coin he owes. Yuri Zarago could talk to Ranmir. Go right ahead. He just might be sober enough to listen to you. See ya. Unless you're bringing me another round, you can just keep walking. The reason I go here is that you need to pay Haran back for all of your drinks. Who are you to say what I should do? I'll pay it's her Argo. back when I'm ready. Rizargo notices that you owe her gold. Pay it. You're right. What would my forefathers think if they knew I wasn't paying my debts? They'd be Tell very disappointed. Bring her the gold I owe. Mm -hmm. Rizargo also thinks it's really terrible if you actually have the gold and just aren't paying it. Just say the word if you need a drink or something to eat. Rizargo talked to Ramir. Everything's gonna be okay. Thank you. He's not a bad man, just bad with his coins and his drink. My husband Dagger could tell you stories there. I have a couple of Ranmir's things that he traded to us back when he was still paying regularly. I say you've earned them. Good day. Interesting. If there's any... if you have business with the college, you're welcome to stay here. It's where most of our business comes from, in fact. Rizargo is uh, wondering about an elven mage here that studies the stars. The mages are up in the college. You can ask them if they'll let you in. Then again, Nelikar might know. He's an old timer from the college, but he has a room here. All right then. My days at the college are long behind ah. me, but I prefer to stay close by. Rizargo did not notice this other elven mage. Dagor and I have an understanding. He gives me privacy, and I make sure my experiments don't blow up his inn. Rizargo was hearing things about the price put on burning the inn down again. Um, but Rizargo is here seeking an elven mage who studies stars. Who sent you? Was it the college? The Jarl? We agreed there would be no more questions. Hmm. Rizargo was sent by the priestess of Azura. You're working with the Daedra? Right. Now tell me the one about the Argonian maid and the lusty baron. Uh, Rizargo has misplaced that book. And, um... Uh, Rizargo just bought land, but here's some money. A few coins for my soul. If only you understood the irony. What do you know about soul gems? Um... Rizargo has used them for recharging enchanting items? They are, except the gem is always consumed. They're frail, Yes. except for one. Ooh. Azura's Star, a Daedric artifact that allows any number of souls to pass through it. Some of us wanted to find out how. I was working under Malin Varan then. If only we knew what he was really planning. And Rizargo does not know what Malin did. Malin wanted to alter the star. He was dying, disease. He thought he could store his own soul inside, become immortal. It drove him mad. Students started dying. Eventually, the college exiled him. He took a few loyal disciples to Illinolta's Deep and vanished. Look, I don't care who asked you to find the star, but don't take it back to Azora. The Daedra are evil. They're the reason Malin went insane. Rizargo knows a man and his dog that would say you're probably correct. Mm hmm. I'm like, oh look, it's an outdoor location. It must be nearby. Nope. 
Okay. Well then. What's this building? Some oddments, a store. Still, this are shopping. I'll sell just about. Oh, it's not going just here to buy things. Rizargo is disappointed. Rizargo admittedly was hoping for iron. What do you mean? Okay. Lot of businesses here. This town is a dump. I think we'll just go to white one. Alright. Um. Well, I started that quest, but. I'm turning around and probably gonna do a little bit of. A little bit on the more homesteading side of things. There's a nip in the air. Cold won't be good for my crops. Never is. Got some good pieces out here if you're looking to buy. More inside. <sighs> there is that a go. Oh, really, there is that a go. Was thinking. Ulfred, patron of the great clan Battleborn, a name I'm sure you know well. I only oh, don't have that house. Farm just outside the city walls, Nimriel takes good care of things. Some of the stuff I can make. All right. These are going to stand here and wait until tomorrow. Some good pieces out. Looking to Rizargo is in the deal some damage. No, neither. Rizargo is here for the materials. Sure. Probably should have just gotten that. Um. Yeah. <laughs> Don't forget to check inside the shop if you need it. Okay. So it is out to go. As that, we will come and we will work a little bit more on property. I wonder how much more I need to worry about. I'm sure there's a quarry at this property too. I just roll my eyes at it as I'm sure I have so, because I had so much excess stone. Um.
I need another 15. Is my quarry. Uh, I would guess top part of this, maybe? Move like here? No. Hmm. Maybe it's around the bottom part of this, these rocks? that or maybe on this side of the dark bench Maybe this place doesn't have a spot to get to quarry stone. You have to bring it from one of the others. going to do is I am going to either find the spot to, to quarry the stone or I am going to just like go ahead and like go to one of my other properties pick it up and bring it back uh, and I'm just gonna build up like the back back half of this house and that's that's where we'll see us next time since I've done that uh, several times before and it's just reclicking a lot of those buttons so join us next time we'll have that and then like maybe next time we'll decide where the family's gonna go or something i don't know or maybe we'll get back to adventuring you know good luck with that right uh still has been fun Zarago enjoys the homesteading got to fight the dragon more homesteading all the fun stuff join us next time for more bye